Welcome everybody to Nova Cover Presents the Red Light District Show Fun Fridays edition. So, hey you guys, so we're starting off at a great location. We are here at the Devil's Gate Dam in Pasadena, California. It's an old sign behind us. They had to actually cover it up so it won't get ruined. Uh, this dam was completed in 1920 and interesting history about all this property going all the way down oh, the, the dam river, history. Okay. The dam history is uh, if you look at that building way back there, it says NASA on it. That is the old JPL Laboratories by Jack Parsons. We know the inventor of American space age technology. He used to be an occultist. And all this property was owned by L. Ron Hubbard, Aleister Crowley, and along with Jack Parsons. They used to do a lot of weird experiments out here. Uh, stories has it though, as we go into the dam, some people who are working on the dam uh, bodies been thrown into the concrete. There are people buried here. The damn bodies. The damn bodies. So along this bridge that you're going to show you tonight, there have been shadow people seen, uh, people walking around. So we're going to look for a lot of that stuff. We have some equipment with us tonight to try out. And as a bonus, we are going to walk down to the cliff, what they call the Devil's Rock, which is a profile of the devil, which lead us into the storm gate that a lot of people have seen on the internet. We're looking up stories of Devil's Gate. So we're going to take you on an adventure to see all the wonders of Devil's Gate. So you guys are ready? Let's go for it. Let's, Let's get go. started. Let's do this. Come on, we're starting the damn tour. We need something to throw down there. <laughs> we should go this way then. Want to go up to the devil, right? Yeah. Well, right. eventually. Apparently, this is the damn fence that we need to climb to save ourselves 20 minutes. Well, it looks like Pat already found his way through. So Pat already found his way through. Where'd he go? Oh, he found the old thing, don't he? Good yeah. job, Pat. Because this is this will take you down five minute walk. You let's go the other way. You have to walk all the way around the fence, and that's like twenty minutes. Let's go the five minute walk. Okay. Oh, that's the fucking devil's head horn right behind you. Yep. So let's just take some pictures and go. What? How are we going to get through that? Dude, we'll open the lid. I'm going down. It's locked. Well, is that Rick? Long, well, it's 20 minutes, but can we go the long way? I mean... I don't know if we can go the long way because there's a lot of water down there. How are we going to close the place? I don't know. Wrap up. Yeah, like yeah Jeff, close. don't do that. Don't put yourself in there and fall all the way down there because that would totally suck. Go for it. <laughs> I like your words of encouragement. Okay. That. I just put my legal out there. I told him not to go. Yeah. All right. Well, Pat did say there is a possible another route. We're gonna go investigate it. Um, it is a man-made, like a deer path or some shit, so maybe we'll go check that out. Maybe we'll get lucky. Maybe we'll get to go down there and see. You know, if you can see that, that is the devil Back down the there. Head. Yep. There's this horn. Right top. And then from down there, you can see, it's, oh, this is a great picture of it. Look at the camera. It's really not bad. You yeah. see that shot of the devil's head right yeah, there? Yeah, the, the, the nose right yeah, here. Yeah, right in the mouth. Yep. That's actually pretty good. It's not horrible. And, and, the, cave, and the cave is like right below the center. Ready to go. I wouldn't go that way. Why? Too much dog food? No. Um, hey, hang on. This is stable. It does the whole thing when you step on it? Yeah, let's not do that part. That's All right, Pat. What happened? Investigating other way around. Uh, found a way down. 
but the earth itself wasn't stable enough for humans to step on and it just went underneath me, just flew down, went down. Geese! Where, oh, geese. geese? We missed the geese. Okay. We well, all missed shit. Geese. All right, so, uh... so we're going to take the long way around. What do you think is about to happen, Jeff? We're about to go down that path and see if we can go a roundabout way to Devil's Gate, which is because uh, both paths we've found are equally sketchy and one wrong move and we will be seeing the devil in person. Exactly. Option two, here we go. Where's this option? We're gonna get there, Jeff. I sure hope so. No. Remind me next fun Friday not to wear like non-hiking shoes. Yeah. I'll do that. I'll put that in the chat. Okay, I'll put a poop rock. Welcome, sirs, to Isengard. We are sitting here on a field of victory, enjoying a few well-earned luxuries. And may I say, the salted pork is particularly good. Huh? What? Say it again. I have to do the whole Isengard shtick again? Yeah. Why? You weren't rolling the first time. It was hard for me to remember the first time. Well, now that I remembered, I could probably say it better. Yeah. Okay. Welcome, sirs, to Isengard. Okay. Oh, these are power cables. This is probably some sort of training course or something. There appears to be, to my right, a very large, very tall jungle gym. It's a uh, where I think people it's, fight to the death. I think it's a. It's all power cables and stuff. So I think it's like a training. Course oh, it for is like, a training course for uh, for yeah. those those linemen. I want to know what's in there though. What? Oh, hang on. Do I need to... Let me get my good lamp. I'm Is going. that open? No. Is it a pull or a push? It's a push. So is it going out? Pat said he would. It's a small one. It's a small one. Brave back. He's got a safety blanket on. It's a towel. Safety towel on. It's for spiders. Uh, spiders are nothing. It's for scorpions. Uh, okay, how about it's for hobos? Okay, what is that spiky fruit looking thing down there? Uh, That's Pat. Spiky fruit? Uh, is it spiky fruit? Can there we go. Can I? <laughs> spiky fruit thing. Yeah, it just goes down. Where? It keeps going? It just keeps going. And going. And going. All right, well, you do you, Pat. Uh, I'll do some more investigation. Okay, have fun. All right, if you get stuck, call us. Okay. Yeah, we'll be right here. We will call somebody to come get you. Yep. All right. Ah, uh, oh, shit. It's, uh, it's pretty compact in here.
it splits into two. Fuck that fucking Sophie's Choice bullshit. Well, I think it's that way, right? Yeah. This is not promising. I remember looking down until it looks very good. So they're going the wrong way? I think they are. Okay, should we tell them or should we let them get lost? I think they're coming back this way now. Okay. Where are you guys going? I'm pretty sure this is the path to the face of the devil. It's right there? Okay. That's what it looked like from up there. I'm just saying there's a path right here. goes to the water and then we can't really get anywhere. Just yeah, but then we'll be on the other side and then we'll just end up right. You can't see the devil's face from here? Yeah. I mean, I can see like the rock over there. We'll still have a ways to go. So that sucks. Yeah. I just wasted all that energy and burned all those calories to come down here for that. Yeah. All right, what do you guys want to sit for 10 minutes so I can get enough energy to go back upstairs? Uh, why don't you guys hang out by the log? Jeff and I and Pat can scatter around real quick. All uh, right, you guys do some B-roll. So is there a... We have to do an under. An under? Okay. Mm -hmm. It's the only human shape area to go. Okay. Do you see Satan yet? There's Satan right there. There he is, right there. Here, let me get my bright lights on. Oh, yeah, okay. Okay, so we made it to the Devil's Rock. Now, here, let's just show the people how dire it is. Like, like we literally cannot pass this wall right here. Yeah, here. Okay, so right down there, a bunch of water that we can't get through. You got this rock that's impenetrable, unless we're gonna get our waders on, which we didn't bring. But uh, behind me, you can see the Devil's Rock. Hold this, I wanna try something. Oh. I'm or say I was on acid doing this. <laughs> That's not all together shot. Well, we tried. Sometimes it's not going to work out. No, it worked out. We saw the rock. Yeah, but we didn't see the gate because inside the gate there's a tunnel and the tunnel goes all the way back and there's all kinds of Satanist shit back there. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. That's the exciting part. Oh, did we get the shot of the across the water? Where? Just keep going down about like two, three minutes. Okay, go come under back. Under the tree again. You know what I mean? Go How? back and. Sh Where am I at? You're Okay, so that's where we need to go. Right there. Okay. Oh, there's a frog! That's a turtle, dude. Hello, frog friend! Looks like it might be 
that's actually, that's not a frog, that's a toad. It's open. Goodbye, frog friend. Into the darkness. I think we can go up and around. Night hiking. Here. Jeff, don't you're gonna fall in the water. See, I told him. Yeah, I mean, there's a small gate opening. One of the bars came off on the far right side of the gate there. So you'd have to like use the two bottom bars as a step and then slide in to get there. And the ladder that's right there goes right next to the gate. And if we were to come around from that angle, we would be able to climb up that ramp and come down. But again, we would have to be able to slip through that crack. Well, any more ideas, folks? What do we have here? What is this? Why do we not address it so far? This is some witch shit right here. Well, maybe because the witches it were wasn't, doing. It wasn't there when we showed up. Is that a bagged off fucking condom right there? Okay, we got witches doing monster and. Pat, knock it over. That starts the events of the Blair Witch Project. Okay. Okay, alright. Oh, wait, okay. <laughs> <Just like, just laughs> Alright, well, well, Sean looks... Well, Sean, did you want to die today? I didn't do that, you guys did that. Yeah, yeah but, but in the Blair Witch me. Project, one guy kicked the rocks and everybody suffered for it. Because you're my friend, and now you have to suffer. It's the horror movie code. Oh, fuck this, I'm not dying tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. All right. So we're just heading back and telling Stefan we need to go to Plan B? Yep. Okay, let's do that. Oh I shit, there's another one, is there? Oh, no, fuck. no, that's not another one. There is another one. Is it? Look, another toad! Look, another toad! Hello, toad friend! Hello, toad f Wow, look at him go! Oh, I love this. This is great. You know, if that's the whole video, just everybody watches and it builds up to me seeing a toad and getting really excited about it, I'm okay with that. I'm okay if we lose a few hundred subscribers for that shit. I live for that. You have to have a few hundred subscribers to so lose a, a few hundred subscribers. We have 1,200, but only four people watch. That doesn't make any sense. I have questions, Stefan. Yeah. Did you get activity about like maybe five minutes ago? Did I get activity 85 minutes ago? No, five minutes ago, roughly. Like someone talking? Anything, at all. Uh, this lit up a couple times, so I put this on and... In that general direction? Yeah. Okay. What? I kicked over a tent. You kicked over a what? I kicked over a tent. A tent? Oh, You'll see in the video, he kicked over a witchy shrine thing. Not that triangle no. thing that was in the middle, right? Yeah. Of sticks? Yep. How did he know? <laughs> Oh shit! <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, I'm trying to get a response. Yeah. You're probably gonna get a response, all right? Uh, babe, can he take another car home? Yeah, you saw Blair Witch, right? Dude, we were saying the exact same thing. <laughs> those, those stories come from oh, something that happened to somebody. Did you guys say Pat? Pat was the one who fucked with you, not Sean. Pat, this guy right here was the one who kicked over your little shrine. Sean is guilty by association. No. Fuck you, Sean. Are you mad at you mad at him? <laughs> she said Pat. Hello. How are we doing tonight? Kicked over your shrine. That sucks, huh? <laughs> Did you put it back up or no? I need to come back with fruit to do that I'm offering, right? Yeah, but I'm sure there's like squirrels and shit around here you can sacrifice. Yeah. There's a lot of toads. I saw a lot of toads in the river. 
What about Jeff? Je Jeff's done ceremonies before. Remember the green arrow thing for the apple? The order of the, the arrow? Green green arrow? Do I have to lose my arm like the green arrow? I don't know. Do you lose, anyone lose your arm in the green arrow scouts? No. We put apples and oranges. Yeah. Apples and bananas, dude. Can I, uh, like, plant a fruit tree or something? Yeah, totally. Find one real quick. Hey. Dude, we got something going on here. Are you here with us? House? You say house? The house that's right there? You want us to go over this weird thing? This is where this thing was started. And I didn't even push the start button yet, dude. Hello? Can you point at the house? Where do you want us to go? What? Can't quite hear you. All right, we'll go over to this house. This is kind of trippy. All right, go forward so we can talk now. Can you come out of there and talk to us? Oh, tell us your name. What? Who's here? Why are you still here? There's a weird place to live. <laughs> There's something down this ladder. Can we get down there? Mesa. Actually, yes, Jeff. This way. <laughs> Where? This way. <clears throat> Is that you? Okay. Yeah, you just walk down the hill and turn left. It's a subtle brain. <laughs> He's gonna discuss it with the old. Oh my god, I'm zooming so in. <laughs> Which side of the road? Huh? Oh, look, being dropped off. Yeah. Look at all this. There's a lot of broken glass. In poverty. I don't know what they call that in archaeology, potsherds. Potsherds? No, potsherds. Yeah, they say sherds. What? Who's that? Sean? Oh, okay. That's about the way I just go. Oh, okay, hey. Sean, it's all pot shirts, man. What's up? They're all pot shirts. Dude, we thought you were selling crazy for a second, and I was like, oh shit. What are these things? These are all glass. I know, what's. Huh? What is that? It's all like people have been throwing stuff off the bridge, like pots and bottles and stuff. So, where does this lead to, do you guys know? I don't know, we haven't gotten over there, but it looks like it's going to end right now. What were you saying? Something pot shards? Yeah, pot shards. That's oh, what they're called. Shards. Yeah. Well, they're, in archaeology, it's pot shards. It's basically crap like this, or just any like random piece of shit that you find on an archaeology site. Like, it's just let's what how it's labeled. That's matter out of place. Yeah. 
Okay, so it looks like so it just it drops off like here. Uh, right? uh, yeah, this is where it all washes out to. Okay, be careful oh, here. Yeah. Yeah, pretty much directly above the Right there, you said? What? See those pointed rocks right here? Yeah, but how are we getting up? Oh, those rocks right there. Yeah, probably. And is that the devil right there? I mean, uh, Sean, okay. right there, straight ahead. So this is where I came out of. That's the tree right there. You see the one closest to us uh -huh. out of the three? That's the one I wanted to tie down. Okay. Yeah, this would be the only way down. So are we trying it? No. Not really. Okay. Well then. If I if uh if I had a GoPro, yes. Okay. If I had this. All right, red light subscribers, you heard it here. Um, you know, if 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 we get if we get a a a five hundred likes, Pat and I will go down into that ravine and we'll go uh into the hole into the devil's hole okay so everybody at home don't forget to like and subscribe by uh, smash that bell icon and all the what are i don't fucking care Get out <laughs>20 about that rock formation okay. if you look at it closely it's rocks that somebody put a coating on almost like a concrete or an outer base on uh -huh. so somebody whoever designed this formed that side view of the devil because that is not a natural formation that was put there right so i don't know alistair crowley l ron hubbard jack parsons Pee Wee herman we don't know but we're gonna find out Somehow. <laughs> Alright, so we found this tennis ball, and this tennis ball is about to go over here. You ready? Let me know. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Here it goes. I didn't even see where it went. Same, dude. Alright. Well, that sucked. That was not Sussy. climactic at all. Chicken and waffles. You ever had chicken waffles, Jeff? Yeah. What do you think of them? I think they're nice. I do okay. How do you prepare your chicken and waffles, though? Waffles? And chicken? Yep. And I eat them separate. I just like waffles and chicken at the same time. Okay, do you put butter? Do you put hot sauce? Do you put um, syrup on? I, I don't put it on the chicken. What? I put it on the waffles. Why? 
This is chicken and what? Well, yeah, what exactly. I'm not having them at the same time. I haven't done that before. What, what? are you talking about? That's it's the only just, way that you're supposed to You've never to had them. chicken and waffles before. Yeah, I've had chicken and waffles. No, he's had chicken plate. and he's had waffles. Chicken and waffles Technically at the same time, on the same plate. Okay, so but I haven't mixed them together. Is it a weird thing for you? No, it's just like, uh, I, I think it might be the syrup with the chicken. So, I'm the kind of guy that goes to KFC and I'll ask for honey to put on my chicken. All right. It's a common thing. A lot of people do it in the South. Yeah. It sweetens it up. It's got the herbs and spices. Really good. I like syrup on my waffles. So together, I totally believe that they can coexist. Oh, for sure. So I could roll my waffles. I could put my chicken in the syrup. It doesn't matter. It's really good regardless. And I'll do the perfect bite where I'll take a little bit of waffle with some chicken fork you know, smear some of that syrup over it and then hit it with some hot sauce. The perfect bite. So are we finishing this episode with chicken and waffles? I think yeah. we might need to. Yeah, yeah okay. absolutely. I'm down with that. Is I that mean, we had this with? hike. We had some interesting things going I on. I got to pee. This guy climbed down to nowhere. The chicken and waffles place. Oh, you're going to love it. Perfect bite. I just found my Manson cave pictures. It's like a reward. Mark Nelson had to help me get up, you know, I was so tired. Currently standing on top of 3,000 bodies buried in Nomad. And it's weird. That's I couldn't see me. them, I just saw like a dark figure. Hey there, guy! I felt uncomfortable coming up oh, this whole road, dude. That was scary.